Hey, what's up? Welcome back to my channel for another video. Today we are gonna do a little Under Armour haul unboxing, sorta. Technically I've already unboxed it um, because I couldn't wait to have a look at it, but we're gonna take a look uh, today and um, I'll show you what I got. So first things first, I'm already holding it. Go straight into it, we got a new backpack. So this one's the one with the Brahma on the front. It has the little UA Storm logo down there as well. Uh, and that means that it's water resistant to some degree, at least. And uh, it seems to have some of the similar pockets to the previous backpack, the Under Armour Storm Contender that I've reviewed. We'll go much more into depth with this one in another video. Just want to show you that this is something that I got. Uh, it was on sale for 45, so it was a really nice uh, pickup from Under Armour. Um, it was about half price, I think, so really good deal. So I thought I would give this this a shot. Um, what I did here, in terms of this backpack, is that I think through reviews I found out that these things are kind of weak, and I'm looking forward to sort of testing that out. Not put a ton of strain on it, specifically. Um, I'm not sure exactly what they did with it, but I'm gonna use it general use and flick it open and shut and do what I would, I suppose, normally do, putting shit in here and see what happens with it. So that'll be another video. We'll, do, we'll go more in depth with this Brahma backpack. Uh, but yeah, it is another Project Rock piece of gear. Next thing. So the other things we got in here were two shirts. Here's the first one. It's like a skinny shirt. It's like more in the style of a muscle tee, but not quite a muscle tee. So I'm wearing something that I, I think would specifically be called muscle tee. It's got that one line string thing down the back. Kind of wondering how the sides are gonna hold up. They're not really seamed that well, so they might curl a bit. They're already curling um, and it's kind of what I see in a lot of stuff sometimes from um, low quality gear companies. Not gear, but clothing companies. So uh, yeah, that's not not amazing. Uh, and it's similar to the headband that I bought a few years ago from Under Armour. And that was a Dwayne Johnson product as well. And that thing, curling a lot. Not gonna lie, it's curling a lot now. Uh, it's unwearable, so um, it didn't last too long. I don't know if it's the climate that I used it in. Surely not, because he tests things in Hawaii. So I was in a Hawaii type climate. Anyway, um, I'm uh, digressing. So the design on this is just a Brahma bowl. It's like a yellow and blue kind of spacey themish type of thing with a gray shirt that's coming across like that, then that's what it looks like. So, not a huge fan of this, just cause the design choices, the colors, not usually my colors to go for. Gonna wear it anyway, obviously. And because I love myself so much, clearly, that uh, we all know it's gonna look good. But <laughs> uh, it's going to uh, serve me well, I think, uh, just for some workouts. Um, but anyway, that's the first shirt. Let's move on to the main attraction, in my opinion. Which is the second shirt. Made in the same exact way. Got a different design here. Hardest worker in the room. Brahma Bull, Under Armour symbol in the middle. I'm a much bigger fan of this style of uh, design. And by that, I'm pretty much specifically talking about the colors. If this was like this, okay. On the other shirt, I can't speak. On the other shirt, if this Brahma Bull was that color, this color on that shirt, basically if this shirt looked like that shirt but it had these colors, that's what I would enjoy. So I was, I'm a huge fan of the, the color choices of this. I wanted to get way more, but they only had one left, unfortunately, but I was very fortunate to at least get one of them. 
that's gonna get a lot of use for my workouts. This already does get a ton of use. I love this shirt. So I I don't know if I did a, I can't remember if I did a video on this, but this shirt is is insanely nice. Um, and this, this shirt is actually much higher quality in my opinion than these shirts and it was the same price. Again, the, these ones are not um, seamed on the sides. It's just like, it's just, it's just a bit of fabric. So if you can get this on sale, I would highly recommend it. That's what I did. These were like 35 Australian dollars when I bought them. Normally 50 Australian dollars, which is kind of high. Uh, and this was 50, but this is much more worth the, the price. This one has got seams all over it. So it's fully protected, even the bottom, fully protected from, um, from curling and uh, fraying over time. So yeah, I'm, I'm not sure how long these are gonna hold up. If they hold up for a significantly short amount of time, I'll definitely let you guys know. Somehow, maybe Twitter or Instagram. I don't see myself doing a full video on just these fraying. <laughs> but uh, that's pretty much it for this haul. Just the three things. Um, and again, we'll do a full video on the backpack, like a quick look and check out all the pockets and stuff that it has because I even haven't had a full look at it. So we can do that together. Anyway, thanks for watching and I will catch you guys in my next video. See ya.